Accompany a salt in a built-up environment. But this isn't Salisbury Plain or Imber Village. It's much more realistic than that. We've been given an opportunity to uh, come up to Leeds from Cottesmore uh, and exercise alongside the Royal Engineers uh, on the building you can see behind us. It's a, a block of flats uh, that was uh, always due for demolition later on this autumn. Uh, and uh, before it's been demolished, we've been given the permission to train in there. Uh, it's a really good urban environment. Uh, usually a lot of our urban training takes place in quite a sterile, uh, slightly contrived training environment, whereas this is, this is real life, real flats with furniture, doors, windows, and all of those obstacles uh, to get in our way. The assault has been carried out by B Company to Royal Anglian and assets from 2-1 Engineer Regiment. And they're up against some bad guys, in this instance provided by soldiers from 4 Parachute Regiment, the local reservist unit in Yorkshire. Uh, I think it's an experience especially for our company because I'd say 80% of our soldiers are really junior so they certainly wouldn't have done anything like this before and I know myself uh, and a couple of the other junior NCOs this is the first time. Um, doing summer in an urban scenario that is actually like a civilian place. To go through it and learn things that we can't really learn while we're doing it in an army training area, uh, it's, it's just a really good benefit to the whole platoon, company and wider army. The one day exercise saw the men and women tackle often dangerous obstacles, simulated casualties and the handling of enemy prisoners. So in terms of like when you go into the rooms, you've actually got like furniture and obstacles, which in urban environments that we've previously trained in is less so. Working uh, alongside the fire brigade uh, and the engineers, it was way more realistic as well because uh, the, their individual skills that they can bring to it was that it just supported us. After a few hours of loud bangs and perhaps some free entertainment for the locals, it was time for Endex. But of course, also time for a photo opportunity to remember this most unique of exercises. James Walton, Forces News. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.